trying to determine the source of the heroin. Happening right now, making sure that local children in need can bundle up this winter. It may feel like summer outside right now, but it's not going to be long before we're all pulling out our coats and our scarves. Well, today, a local foundation made sure that thousands of needy Philadelphia school kids will not go cold this winter. Fox 29's Don Timoney has the story. Today's warm temperatures made it a no-jacket-required kind of day. But these Philadelphia elementary school children were bundling up. The students all eager to try on their brand-new winter coats. I like it because I never got a jacket in a long time. I picked out a purple coat because that's my favorite color. I picked out a pink and blue um, jacket. It's nice and cozy. The free coats in all different colors and sizes are courtesy of the Philadelphia Auto Dealers Caring for Kids Foundation. This is the sixth year for their Driving Away the Cold program. What can we do? What was a big need and one we thought was coats for kids and them being warm in the winter. So where did all these coats come from? 180 local car dealers pledged a coat for each car sold during the month of September and the result, 31,000 coats. 6,000 are being handed out today, the other 25,000 later this month. It's like the best day of my whole entire life. It means a lot because they're trying to all put every all their effort together and give us all coats. The foundation also presented the mayor with a $50,000 check for the Philadelphia Education Supplies Fund in light of the challenges facing the school district. Wonderful that the community is reaching out to us and seeing, you know, that this is these are the things that we need, not just as teachers, but the kids too. So it's a huge impact on everybody. That impact is being felt inside and outside the classroom. The coat giveaway to date has warmed both the bodies and souls of more than 140,000 area children. John Timoney, Fox 29 News. All right, that is a great story. And checking back in with your weather and Caitlin Roth is usually.